this isn't gonna work. <laughs> I can't even see over this box. Oh, I hope I didn't just cut what's in the box. Ugh. Oh yeah. What is up guys? My name is Mark Senrio. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the RC vlog. Got a box guys. We're gonna go through what's in this box real quick. Got a few announcements to make. Am I even centered right now? I feel like I'm super far away. Oh well. Ah, Alright. So what's in the box? Boom. Protec buggy tire bag. There's actually a reason why I bought this. I actually used the Proline tire bag for my tires but I bought this one because I have a whole bunch of crawler tires like beadlocks and stuff like that that are just sitting out I don't want them to dry out what's cool about this bag is it comes with with these guys so it like seals it kind of airtight that way your tires don't dry out so oh it's close too because <laughs> this crawler tires are pretty large oh beautiful Look at those. Those look so good. Those are the beadlock rings that Mr. Mark bought me off of Chico's. They turned out so freaking good. I think I showed these already, but I, I just I just really like them. All right, so let's see what else is in the bag. Obviously, this wasn't it. I already have one of these. I already did a review on it. I showed you guys. This is the ProTech RC car backpack. It's like a hauler bag. I did a YouTube short, and you can fit pretty much any scale crawler, 10 scales, 10 scale scale crawler in this bag. Also, you can fit a short course in it. After I saw that, I had to get another one, but I got another one. And, oh nice. I got the ProTech bags to put inside. So, I know what you're saying. I know what you're asking yourself. Mark, why would you buy two setups? You already have one. You're such a waste of money. Well, it's because I like them, and I have several cars, and I actually bought a setup to give away. Wait, you're gonna give me one of those? No, it's actually last month's Patreon contest prize. That's right, one of these setups, a backpack and a tool bag, is gonna go to one of my Patreons. That's October's giveaway. We didn't do a giveaway or a contest. I can't say giveaway, a contest in October, so this is the prize for the October contest. If you aren't a Patreon, you don't know what it is, I'll put a link in the description below. I have a limited amount of spots for being Patreon, so I can only have so many Patreons. And usually it's filled up. We do have some availabilities right now, so if you want to have access to chat with me, ask me questions, whatever you need, see some behind the scenes stuff, and also get a chance to win some giveaways, contests, go check it out, sign up for Patreon. If you're an existing Patreon, appreciate all the support. You guys are awesome. Thanks a lot. All right guys, we're actually heading back to the Traxxas store because we're gonna pick up my new XRT today. And word on the street is they got a pretty cool TRX4 M setup and they have some of the accessories on display. So we're gonna go check those out. All right, try not to get hit by an RC car. All right, we're here at the Traxxas store. We're hoping to see all the colors of the TRX4 M. That's what I hope to see. I don't know if they're gonna be out yet, but we definitely want to check out the new TRX4 M display and uh, pick up my, my XRT, even though I already said that. Ooh, look, the Traxxas exclusive deal. That's a new sticker. That's new. Oh man, look at that thing. The Traxxas TRX4 M display. Look at this, this is like a simulated mud, which is really cool. The cars are on the other side. I think we can drive them. But look, you can see all the accessories up here. We're gonna take a look at some of the accessories today. I am gonna do a couple of builds on them. Um, but I gotta plan them out. I'm not just gonna start pulling trigger on this stuff because there's a whole bunch of stuff here. Well, let's see, let's get one of these things turned on. It's on already. So they don't have all the colors of the TRX4M, but they have the red Defender. Uh, that one's pretty cool. I saw this one the other day. I didn't shoot it, but there's the red one. And then this is the blue one that I have, but we're gonna do some we're gonna do some crawling on this thing. Let's see if I can back the trailer up. I can I can do this in real life. I don't know if I can do it via or oh look at that. I freaking jackknifed it already. I'm driving one hand without a thumb steer, guys. I'm doing my best. Oh, I got this. Got it. Oh my god. Jackknife. I okay, I just gotta move with my hand. Sorry guys. Alright, here we go. We're going to the mud. Friendly push. Wait, does this one have the high 
two gears. That one. Oh, that's the. Oh, very, dude, very nice. You pulled it right from the camera like a boss. <laughs> All right, these have different gears. I think the blue one has the low speed gears, and this one has the stock ones. We're going to drag race them, see the difference. I really want the high speed gear ones, but we'll see. Okay, we're backing up. I think I'm completely blocking one of the drivers. All right, on your mark, get set, go. Oh my God, <laughs> the slow one is mega slow. Jeez, that is a, a super low gear ratio. That's insane. Jeez, what a hack. <laughs> nice. Seriously? Look at these guys. This is what they do all day. <laughs> I'm just joking. Check this out, guys. They have a TRX Forum accessory mat, which is really freaking cool. Uh, as soon as I saw this, I saw this. And uh, that's a clear body. They don't, they're not making that green body. I mean, you can always buy the green paint, but there's the different bodies. Look, they're gonna have aluminum C hubs and hubs and stuff. Uh, man, there's so many different accessories. Look, they have brass. So if you wanna make it a better crawler, you can do brass. The brass wheel hexes are pretty cool. Dang, brass spring retainers. What's that? Oh, the bearings? Oh, transmission bearing set. The different transmissions. The shocks, oh god, those look so, I'm, I am so excited to accessorize one of these. That, I might go and just get that today, because I feel like we need to go ahead and start playing with the trailer. But man, so many different options. Let's go take a look at them on the actual uh, board here, because they got them all up over here. They're starting to fill stuff up, there's still some stuff missing, but different color uh, diff cases, which is really cool. I, I think this is really cool, this is just the servo, the servo mount? I don't know why I think it's so cool, but it's cool. They got the assembled axles, it's pretty sweet. Look at this, oh dang. I think those are the, the center drive shafts, those are really cool. And then stainless steel hardware kit. Man, they got all different types of stuff. Hey, is it bearings in there or bushings? Oh, it is bushings, so they make a bearing set. Man, bearing sets are cool and all, but you actually have to take them apart and, and put them in. That's the only problem with the bearing set to me. I would go that way, but I'm scared they're gonna run me over. Actually, I know they would run me over. Got little heat sinks. That's pretty cool. Oh man, no, I did not say run me over. I said, I figured you'd run me over. Different shock bodies. Oh man, I can't wait. I can't wait. So you can get the transmissions to just drop, drop in new transmission and have it faster or slower. But if you just change the gear set, the motors are actually the same. It's just a different gear set, so. If you want to do a little more work, you can get uh, the high speed transmission by just changing out the gears. Different color bead locks. These are really, really cool. Actually, wait, where are the bead locks? Oh, here's the bead locks. So you got different color bead locks here. Here's the blue bead locks. This is the black bead locks. Here's the brass, the brass wings. <laughs> wings. The, the brass rings. That's actually pretty heavy. I bet you that would make your car perform really well. Hold on, wait, they're doing stunts. Check out these stunts. They're stunting TRX 4Ms. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Get him! My God, that's full pin, huh? Yep. Jeez. <laughs> there she is, guys. The XRT Special Edition Black. So my understanding is, and I could be wrong, that yes, there are sleeping bags in there, and that's for another video that I'm doing on MSM every day. <laughs> but my understanding is on the black, is for the first 90 days, it will only be available at Tra Traxxas exclusive stores. And then after that 90 days, anyone will be able to get it. So it's not, I mean, it's special, and I'm gonna show you why it's special when we get home. Actually, I can show you here. But it's not special where you're not gonna be able to get it. You should, you should be able to get it, in theory. That's what I heard, I, I can't confirm that, but that's what I heard. All right guys, here's something new that Andy just informed me about. So this is actually the new color red body rustler. Um, this is the older red body rustler. This, they actually make this now, and they're 199. I think it comes without, without the lights, but this is a new paint scheme. So it's a little different than the old one, but I think they're bringing in some new designs, which is really, really cool. There is the E-Revo Black Edition. That's what it looks like. This one's been out for a while, but the reason why I'm showing you this 
And see how on the E-Revo it still has the blue anodizing? Well, on the new XRT, the reason why I think it's really cool is because it's one of the first cars that comes with the black anodizing. So the shocks are black shocks, anodized black. Also the hubs are black. I think that's sweet. It's like all murdered out. I am so excited about this thing. I don't even think I'm gonna drive it. And I know that's gonna make a lot of you guys mad, but it's, it just looks too nice. So this is what you would see at your local hobby shop if they got the T if they have the TRX4 M's already. It's this little display right here, which is really, really cool. I wish I could get this thing. But on the back, we'll have all those accessories that we just looked at on that little mat, which are all these. But this is what you should see at your local hobby shop. In the comments, tell me what color you like. I'm gonna get a couple more because I like them so much. Again, I have the green Defender and the blue Bronco, but what other colors do you guys like? In the comments below, let me know what color you like. Well, that's a wrap, guys. I hope you liked this video. If you did, smash the like button, subscribe to my channel, turn on the notification bell, and you guys will see you next time. Later, guys.